AJ's one of those kids, it's, he's like a lot of other kids coming up in Forsyth and Monroe County and Mary Persons. He's been playing football forever since he's a little kid. And then he's been around our program the whole time too. I mean, he was a ball boy when he was younger and then, you know, coming up through middle school. And then, you know, last year he, he was a ninth grader, but actually dressed out and did play a little bit on the varsity. And then, um, sprained his ankle about halfway through the season and it never really healed up and just a lot of swelling started staying in it and did a few other tests and that's when they found out that you know he had a he had some issues with his kidneys um but he's just like every other kid that that is here they they love mary persons football and they're bulldogs from the time they're real real little and and uh you know the only difference with aj is he he was with us the whole time he's like i said ball boy and everything else i mean he's been He's been around our football program since he was probably in third grade. The Touchdown Club set up an account at, at United Bank that, that donations can go to. Um, we're going to start selling the, uh, some bracelets, the AJ Strong bracelets, that uh, the money from the proceeds from that will go uh, into his fund. And then just talking to people like you or, or the news stations and trying to get his story out there, social media, you know, every kind of avenue that we can try to explore to get his story out there to see that there might be somebody out there that can help him. Uh, it, it means a lot, you know, every day these these people that I, I don't I know, don't know, friends, family and teammates that come in to help help out this situation, it means a lot.